I look after memory marketing and I am responsible for the EMEA region. If we look at memory technology, we see that one of the early drivers was the PC market, then it moved to mobile, but now in recent times we see a lot of challenges coming from the automotive market and that makes it very exciting. In Europe, we see automotive as one of our key markets. We're dealing today with the infotainment system, the digital cluster, but definitely ADAS and autonomous drive is what's going to make the future very exciting. We have memory solutions for all the sensors, but also as a central compute unit needs to do a lot of intelligence and decision making, that's also going to drive memory bandwidth and density. One very simple USP of Samsung is we always want to have the smallest and laser process technology. That allows us to make the smallest chips, and with that, we have a cost benefit. So, my first trip to Korea was in January, and my clear memory from that trip, it was really cold. The people I found were very warm, so a lot of teamwork, everybody joined dinners in the evening, and generally we had a lot of fun. We were like a family. In the 25 years I've been in Samsung, I've seen an awful lot of change. We've moved building four times, I've seen customers emerge, disappear, applications evolve. But I think the summary I take from this is that change keeps happening. It's inevitable. Every day, every year, every decade, something is different. It keeps it exciting.